Oops. Hey everyone, Nam here again. I just wanted to make a video um, about why being an adult uh, stinks. Just give you a quick example to start off the talk uh, right off the bat. So today I had a car inspection and it didn't pass inspection. And they said, well, if you want it to pass, you're going to have to pay $2,000 to trust them and use the bottom. Uh, I'm not paying money for $2,000 for an older car. It's it's a uh, 2000 and I said at that point, you know, I just like might as well just get a new car, which thankfully I've already started saving up for. Um, and I'm in a living situation right now where I'm okay. Um, I, I currently live with my dad. Yes, I do. I know. But, I, you know, I'll get to that in a second about uh, my next point here. Um, so I got that taken care of. It was still a stressor, though. I wish it. I wish I had it for another two years because would that would have meant I would have had it. Sorry, I have a – I've got a, a bush here. Uh, I would have had, I would have, I wanted to have it for at least 10 years. I had it for eight. It's okay, but uh, so you know, it's not like so a car. It's not like when you're 16, you get a brand new car. You're, you know, you show it off your friends and you know that girl. You know, it's t it's actually taking care of it, making sure you're maintaining it, so that way you can get to point A, point B, and go to go to get, be able to get to work, so you can you know, do pay bills. Um, you know, I, I take care of my car. Uh, I help take care of uh, garbage. Uh, garbage bills and groceries so i'm good there my dad takes care of like you know electricity and heat so you know but those the, um unless you're like you, you know that's another thing so i, I don't want to get off topic but you know so bills you know as soon as your paycheck comes and you're like yes yeah, payday paid out of your hand pay to see it so you know kids you know you you know, I always used to think, you know, if I asked my parents for, like, a new toy or a new video game or something, it's like, why can't they do that? Because my dad makes money, uh, you know, so, I mean, I, I don't understand it. They're so cheap. I I want this now, and, and, it's, and it's like, oh, my gosh, you, you try to maintain a budget now. Like, you know, that's part of the other reason, trying to maintain a budget. Um, taking care of a house. I mean, that's, that's, that's uh a chore on top of that too you know you got to make make sure it's clean uh, uh uh laundry you gotta do laundry how about remember when you were a kid you know all you have to worry about is your mom or dad coming to you give me your dirty clothes so you know you we, we, we already have that and throw it down the laundry chute uh so you know you don't have to is and it is as insignificant it is and something small task every night after i get my shower i put it in the in the washer and sometimes i sometimes don't get it to the next day after it's done washing then I have to put it in the dryer. So I like to be on top of that to make sure I have it washed and dried the same night. But, you know, it, all that takes about uh, about an hour or so. And, but, you know, it's it's an hour of my time that I'm, wor I'm worried about not being able to relax and just watch TV and then maybe fall asleep. So, you know, responsibilities in general. Um, pets. Now I have right now two cats. Uh, I recently had a dog uh, two years ago that I had to put down. But, um... I mean, at times, though, as a kid, you know, if you wanted a dog or, or a, a cat or something, you you always promise your mom and dad, I promise I'll take care of it, I'll feed it, I'll take it out, I'll walk it, I'll, I'll clean up after it. And, you know, of course, mom and dad always took care of that in the end. But, you know, it's not that you didn't love the dog or something and enjoy his presence, or, you know. But, uh, so that's another thing um, that uh, being a dog kind of stinks. Um... What am I also looking at? Like I said, I didn't compile a list. But, oh, yes. Okay, for example. Um, this one I actually kind of like doing once I start get going. Mowing the lawn. I push mill. So it takes me about uh, my yard about an hour and a half. Uh, and I usually do it on Fridays because I like to give it a week in between, especially with the heat we're having. But that's beside the point. Um, so, so, you know, oh, yes, I finally got the work week done, you know. Uh, but, you know, at, during work... That day, I'm like, man, I gotta go home and mow the lawn. I gotta go. So as soon as I, and as soon as I get home, parked in, I go right to my uh. I have my mowing shoes, basically my mowing my boots for outside. Uh, as soon as I walk in the door, t t take off my work boots, put on my outside shoes, go out behind the shed here, uh, start the lawn mower and mow the lawn. So it's like, oh man, you know. So you know, again, responsibilities, mow the lawn, you know. Um. What else is there? I mean, it's like, okay, you you think you have more freedom, or from a kid's perspective, you think as an adult, oh, you're going to have all this freedom, you're going to be able to do this, you're going to be able to do that. 
in, in some ways, yes, but you're limited because, you know, your budget, your money, you got to make sure you're all right. Um, you can go out, but with the job I have, uh, I work in a factory. It's nothing fancy. Um, I'm making probably gross and probably about, I don't know, 20, around 25000 or so. I know that's probably chump change to some, but, you know, I'm, I I manage and, um, and I'm sure in time I'll make more uh, as, as wages go up. That's another thing, inflation and stuff. I think that's not really so much being an adult, but that impact, because as an adult, you worry about it. As a kid, as a kid you wouldn't. But uh, what was I saying? Um, see, I, I, I do these things where I get lost or just go off in a tangent and I forget what I was saying. But, uh, uh, I mean, you know, um, oh, yeah, you know, you're going out, you know, you think you have more freedom, but like essentially, okay. In a way, you do, but as a kid, you have no responsibilities. You go, you just, you know, say, "Hey, I'm going over to Billy's house," you know, or something, and you go ride bikes. And you know, as an adult, where it's kind of like everything's got to, you know, a work day has to come to an end, or, or the weekend has to come. You don't get summer vacation either. That's another thing, right there. You don't get a summer vacation unless you're a teacher or something. But I mean, about I'd say ninety. Other than teachers, off the top of my head, I don't know who gets a summer vacation. Uh, so, you know, you're, you're still working through the summer. So that's it. Um, you know, I think I'm kind of pretty much hit the uh, nail on the head of pretty much of what I've covered. Uh, I hope I'm not coming off as whining. I, 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 this was just kind of more of a lighthearted, you know, enjoyment video of something that I hope that you and I can all relate to and laugh about. I mean, I enjoy, I enjoy life. I enjoy, you know, I, I, and I enjoy people that I work with. That's a blessing. You know, so it's um, the only thing I hate about work is not work itself is is waking up. That's another thing. Uh, so I, to be fair, that's as a kid, I always had that. I hated waking up to go to school. I hated waking up to go to work. I hate it. I especially now I love being able to sleep in until like eight, nine o'clock. And that's for some people, that's probably not sleeping in. But I hate I hate ways to sleep in the day. But, but uh, that, that said, OK, I digress. Don't want to be a long tangent video. This is really fun. So with that said, feel free to let me know. Uh, you know, you're what what you uh, find kind of annoying. I know that what stinks about being a dog. With that said, as always, I'm Nam. Always use your noodle.